trading professionally, and when I'm saying trading professional, doesn't mean trading all day, full time. You can be a professional trader and still trading part time. Trading right now in 2020, 2021 is not anymore only about trading price action, knowing the levels, knowing where are support or resistance, uh, understanding the flow, understanding the tape. It's more trading at the highest level is purely algorithm and uh, I would say uh, manipulated in a sense that uh, we cannot ever follow the mass because the mass will generally be trapped. We have instead to be the hunters and avoid to be in the part of the sheeps. So one of the key things, aspects in trading is about stats. The stats that you can see over here are what really you need for your trading and you can filter. So I'm looking for a certain amount of gap stats. I'm looking for a percentage, I'm looking for a volume. And then I can see, for example, on the stock BBIG that on four gaps, we have at least 75% of faders. So three out of four, they faded. And the high of day time is 1052. So we know that between 10 and 1130, they will try to fail. And then how much do they fail by average? Around 22%. And I have a key stat already. I know that on the majority of these uh, gaps, I will have more faders. Of uh, being very important over here, the number. So the higher the number over here of the gaps, the more reliable these numbers. If we have three gaps or two gaps and we have 50-50 is not very important. If we have two gaps and we have two times close red, it's not very important. But if we have 10 gaps and we have 75% close red, then I can assume that that stat is more effective, okay, has more volume than a stock with only three or four gaps.